He made me apologize for everything. Everything. Including the things I did right. I practically apologize for a living. Hello, wonderful viewers, amazing people. Welcome back to Entertainment TV. This one, another matter. Ha. Be like, say, this love I won't scatter everywhere. Finally, you. Be like, say, now, violence. People, they settle for now. They don't like peace. This one, uh, another matter, as Hattress Wumi Toriola will be, say she be popular, Nollywood actress, was accused of beating her mother-in-law. Wumi Toriola has broken silence after she was accused of beating her mother-in-law. This lover, no, they tire for people's matter, as this lover, had earlier reported that the actress Mary crashed because she allegedly beat her mother-in-law. According to this lover, this lover further released charts from her husband confirming that the actress indeed used to beat her mother-in-law. Now, the actress don't come out. She talks, say, she not be violent kind of person. That how can she ever raise her hands on her own mother, talkless of her mother-in-law. Make I read them very well for you people to understand. In her words, she said, there has been a lot of media attention on me lately. Regarding my marriage, yes, it is true the marriage is over. We have gone our separate ways for over a year now. It did not work out. There was no need for drama, hence my reason for not letting my fans know. But yesterday, I saw a report where it was alleged that I was violent while the marriage lasted, and that I used to beat my mother and my mother-in-law. It was reported that my ex allegedly concocted these lies. For the record, I am not a violent person. I have not had to exchange punches with anyone, and I was never violent in the marriage. The most painful part of the report is that I used to beat my mother. This is not only personal attack, it is satanic. It is against everything I stand for and believe. As a properly raised Yoruba lady, it is costly to list your, your ends against your parents. As a matter of fact, my mom has been late for over 20 years and I never raised my hands against my mother-in-law. It never happened and it will never happen. My family members, my ex-family members, and our neighbors can testify to it. I wish those who started the rumor and those spreading well and pray that God rewards every one of us according to the words of our hands. As for me, I am focused on the next level and I have moved on from the past. I advise everyone else to do the same. Amazing people, this one, another one, though. A lot of netizens have been reacting concerning this actress post. They talk say she can never, they don't even see her as that kind of a person. She no be violence kind person. We go con, they beat her mother, talk less of her mother-in-law. A majority of them believe that the ex-husband was just making up stories against her. Amazing people, what do you think about this particular matter? Before I end this video, I'm going to share some of the comments I read online. One of the netizens shared, he said, A lady called Grace, your strength and resilience knows no bound. Next level. Igbadu Tutu, incoming husband come with your PhD, ATM, PVC, birthday, reference from your exes. A liable, notable guarantor. We can't avoid one chance. Respect. Another one said, And lastly, he shall not die but live to declare the glory of God. It is well with you. So, wonderful viewers, share with me in the comment section. What do you think about this post? About the initial post and this current post that was made by the actress on debunking the rumor that has been going on here and there about her beating her mother 
or our mother-in-law. 